We are here at the Greater Toms River Chamber of Commerce's first annual Sup the River event. It's awesome. All the suppers are out there. I don't know if I could do it, to be honest. We have the river lady behind me. They just had a networking breakfast, so we're going to greet some of the guests out there. And this is awesome. Socially Ever After is here to capture it all. Noel Carino and we're at Sup the River. It was awesome. Can you tell us a little bit about the event today? Yeah, so Jim Buffum from the Toms River Country Club team came to us last year with this great idea. So they have this beautiful venue here with this untapped beach and he said, hey, wouldn't it be cool if we did this paddleboard race? And I was like, yeah, that sounds great, but Chamber of Commerce paddleboard race, I didn't really see the, the connection. But we decided to loop in the River Lady. We've got a networking breakfast out there um, and also the Barnegat Bay Partnership so that the por a portion of the proceeds goes to a wonderful organization that is benefiting the Bay, um, one of our beautiful resources. And we pulled together this great collaborative effort from um, just a whole bunch of really related mission-minded vendors and partners. And so we're really excited. So we've got a six-mile race, a two-mile race, and a sprint race for fun. We've got Hornet Paddles out here through Paddle Works and uh, Barnegat Bay Partnership, WJRZ is out here. Um, Mike Jacobus and Novins York and Jacobus was a sponsor and Fuse Environmental. We had a whole bunch of people really pitch in uh, to make this happen. The Yacht Club, the Sheriff's Department, everybody kind of threw their, threw their hats in. We're thrilled. I have goosey bumps. I'm very <laughs> excited. Um, this is the first time we've ever done anything like this. Everybody is already saying, so what's the date next year? And I've already picked one, Saturday, September 16th. So nice. it's official. We are doing Mark your today. calendars. Jeremy Grunin, the chairman of the Greater Toms River Chamber of Commerce. And uh, did you get out there on a paddleboard today? Uh, I was safely, safely positioned on the River Lady. Yes, because my balance is uh, is uh, less than stellar, so it would have been just a comedy show. So I did the right thing and stayed on the River Lady, where I could stay upright. Noel and Danielle. Uh, had an unbelievable idea of how we could bring more folks to kind of really appreciate the Jersey Shore and appreciate uh, the natural resources that we had. Jim Buffum and the Country Club have been fantastic in, in pitching in and, and making their venue available and kind of retrofitting it to do the right things. Uh, Mike Jacobus, uh, Matt Latano, a whole bunch of people came together and it's really been, you know, for our first year, it's been a great event and really a great way to showcase all we have to offer here in Tom's River. Can you tell me a little bit about Barnegat Bay Partnerships mission? Sure, we're part of the National Estuary Program. So there are many estuary programs throughout the country and we all want to manage our bay because it's under threat from some usually overdevelopment, um, non-point source pollution. So our mission is both scientific, we do scientific research on all the critters in the bay we want to know what we have out there and how to protect it, how to improve their populations. We also do public outreach with children. We have a watershed ambassador who goes out to classrooms and shows them on this model that we have over there, the Enviroscape, how pollution happens and how you can avoid it. A new website, jerseyyards.org, and we list not only native plants, but plants that are friendly to New Jersey. So. You can still have your favorite plants, some of them, and we tell you why some others are not good to plant here in New Jersey. Basically, we just want people to understand this great resource that we have here and how they can protect it because it takes all of us working together to protect the Barnica Bay. I'm here with Jonathan Petro from Carlucci Leone Diamond Oil and Sachs, a co-managing partner of the firm and also my former boss. So I love him how are you doing today i'm doing very well we miss you a lot at the firm so what are you doing out here today 
Uh, we're here supporting the uh, Greater Toms River Chamber of Commerce for their Sup the River event. And I'm also here as a board member for the Toms River Country Club, which is where the event's taking place today. Um, just here to support. My husband, Ken, is out there paddle boarding. He is the first vice chair of the Chamber of Commerce, so he's here supporting as well. But he's on a board uh, on the river right now. And he's got to hurry because you're going to need to catch a plane soon? We are. We're <laughs> running to the airport in about a half hour, so he better paddle fast. <laughs> Thank you.